smart marketing. It's product placement. It's like if the star of your favorite movie, now I totally forget the name of the movie now, the one where he drives a 69 Pontiac GTO Judge. Is it The Punisher? I think it is The Punisher, isn't it? He drives the exact my exact first car, the same year and my, it. You know what I'm talking about, right? It's all flat black. Oh, it's smoking. Yeah, until it is actually smoking and burning. But so that's product placement. Product placement. You know, what are we going to give the good guy for a vehicle? What are we going to give the bad guy? What are we the the female hero or the male hero? How what what fashion? What products are they going to wear when they're in in the in the uh, restaurant scene? What what beer are they drinking? James Bond, what watch is he wearing? It's just good marketing. So now you go to the next level, and the intelligent community is masters of this, and in some cases they're masters of Americans, unfortunately, but we'll talk about that another time. It's the same thing. Can we get that guy to say this? So maybe you want to push the gay agenda in this, in this episode. Maybe you want to push the green energy agenda. I mean, it, it goes so far beyond idiot, leftist, bought-off news people. It goes far beyond that. And for those of us, like yourselves, who have been paying attention, everybody knows Top Gun was a recruitment film, the first one. Did you know he's coming out with a third? Big mistake. That's what I heard. I saw the second Top Gun, Tom Cruise, Top Gun Maverick. It was awesome. The first one, awesome. Why are they coming out with a third? What's that all about? Why would you do that? You have more money than God. Talk about leaving on a high note. The second one topped the first one 30 years later. What, what's, what's Top Gun 3 going to be? I'm flying a balloon. Hold on a second. Hey. 